to take an educated, obviously very intelligent man and assume that he has a lack of respect for women because he has cartoon women on a shirt is fucking sexist. This man has done nothing to show that he has any sexist beliefs and to make him this week's scapegoat for feminist theory advocates is cold fucking blooded. You deserve only respect, Matt Taylor, and I, Leather Rebel Justice, on behalf of the entire human race, apologize for the sick ones that wanted to shame you. I, also, on behalf of the entire human race, nominate you, Matt Taylor, for King of All Humanity. I love you, Matt Taylor. Please love me, too. I, Leather Rebel Justice, nominate you for King of Humanity. That's right, that's from the heart, Matt Taylor. I love you. I love you. It's like, come on, people. It's like, come on, people. Haven't you figured out that the male sex drive is sexist just by being in existence? It's NASA scientists with women on their shirts. Next, there will be women everywhere. We'll see women on posters. We'll see women, maybe even advertising shit. Maybe even advertising stuff. It'll be hell. It'll, it'll just simply be hell. And of course, because the male sex drive is what it is, we'll just think of these women and we'll start to think of all women as just nothing more than a collection of body parts because that's what, that's what happens in the male sex drive. We just see someone we're attracted to and we could never love them or treat them with respect. Yeah, that's not a sexist belief at all. Well, that's not sexist to males at all. I got an owie. I got an owie. Look, pus comes out of it. Pus. It's real pus. You made me pus my own pus. Okay. People think that feminism should go to the Middle East where women can't even leave their house without being accompanied by a man, but fuck that, that's in another country. We have real issues of sexism right in our own... We have real issues of sexism right in our own country. And it's just as bad as the Middle East. Just as bad. And it's just as bad as the Middle East. Just as bad. And it's just as bad as in the Middle East. Just as bad. I know that if I'm attracted to a girl, I couldn't possibly respect her or treat her fair. Because, you know, I'm a man and we're just all like that. That's not a sexist belief in the least. That's not sexist in the least. Because all of us men, we just do that. I mean, it's not like we could fall in love with someone we're attracted to or anything. That's just not possible, knowing the male sex drive. I want to say, on behalf of the entire human race, that Matt Taylor, we love you. You deserve respect. And we love you. You've done nothing wrong. You've done nothing wrong, and you deserve nothing but respect. Well, nothing. I mean, you deserve, like, a fucking the new Nintendo products and shit. This man has done nothing to show that he has... This man has done nothing to show that he has any sexist beliefs, and to make him this week's scapegoat for feminist theory advocates is very cold-blooded. Is very cold fucking blooded. Is cold fucking blooded. Is very cold blooded. This man has done nothing. Wait. This man has done nothing that shows he has any sexist beliefs, and to make him this week's target of feminist theory. Oh, wait. This man has done nothing. This man has done nothing to show that he has any sexist beliefs, and to make him this week's scapegoat for feminist theory advocates is very cold-blooded. This man has done nothing to show that he has any sexist beliefs, and to make him this week's scapegoat for feminist theory advocates is very cold-blooded. Obviously very intelligent. Obviously very intelligent. Obviously very intelligent. Well, 
that's not sexist to males at all. And it's just as bad as the Middle East, just as bad. 